Any small miscalculation on this rally soon ended in a freezing shower that could easily confuse. The Welshman was dropping time. It was dizzying stuff, but not in the way he'd hoped. Here, he was getting lucky. And getting lucky early, damaging his Hyundai. But that was only cosmetic. Gronholm remembered how this rallying business was done. Gronholm, here on stage four. The answer? No! A tree this time. But not like this, Thierry. At this point, Nerville had been only six seconds off the rally lead. A little less speed, a little more haste was required. This episode had cost him two places on the leaderboard. Citroen's young Finn, Esapeka Lappi, was about to find that out. Or maybe we should call him Harry Houdini. What an escape act. Into trouble and out of it as well, and all in a flash. And Lope could console himself that his Hyundai shovel was still locked in the boot. Gary Matty Latvala had been ahead of his Toyota teammate since the lunchtime halt, but now, on tyres where the studs were losing their grip, Latvala lost control off the top of a small crest. A nupu, as the Finns call them, and unlike his fish, there was no escape to freedom. By contrast, Tamo Sunan and stunning Friday was coming to a very successful end. Now he wants to be a big catch in this sport. But first, he just wanted his special light pods to stay on the front of his car and not ruin his big moment. Tamo Sunanen took just a little bit too much speed down into a snowy corner on stage 10. And suddenly he was in the hands of the gods. Very easy to break the gearbox trying to get out of places like that. The hands of the gods and the fans. Sunanen sinking and tumbling from the rally lead. He'd made changes to his car at lunchtime, but it could still get away from him when it wanted. He rode his luck through the snow in stage 13. Because of this oversight. In the 12th kilometre of the stage, he crashed and slid further away from the point spaces. The young Finn in a hurry to make up time for an earlier moment and in too much of a hurry. Pride dented. He moved past Mickelson into third, but when he tried to make up time on Lappy, a small, snowy mistake. In all that white stuff, it was easy to do. Fighting the car. A couple of crucial seconds were lost. Wait, wait, wait. Wait.